Mysuru Dussehra Kannada, Dussehra Habha is the Natahaba state festival of the state of Karnataka in India. It is a ten-day festival, starting with Navaratri Navaratri means nine nights and the last day being Vijayadashami. The festival is observed on the tenth day in the Hindu calendar month of Ashvan, which typically falls in the Gregorian months of September and October. The Hindu festival of Dussehra, Navratri and Vijayadashami celebrates the victory of good over evil. It was the day in the Hindu legends when goddess Chamundeshwari Durga killed the demon Mahishasura. Mahishasura is the demon whose slaying by the goddess gave the city the name Mysuru. The Mysuru tradition celebrates the warriors and the state fighting for the good during this festival, ritually worshipping and displaying the state sword, weapons, elephants, horses along with Hindu Devi goddess in her warrior form predominantly, as well as the Vishnu avatar Rama. The ceremonies and a major procession is traditionally presided by the king of Mysuru. The city of Mysuru has a long tradition of celebrating the Dussehra festival with grandeur and pomp to mark the festival. The Dussehra festival in Mysuru completed 400th anniversary in year 2010, while evidence suggests the festivities were observed in Karnataka state by the Vijayanagara Empire kings in the 15th century. Topic History The Dussehra festivities began with the Vijayanagar kings as early as the 15th century. The festival played a historical role in the 14th century Vijayanagara Empire, where it was called Mahanavami and the festivities are shown in the relief artwork of the outer wall of the Hazara Rama Temple of Hampi. The Italian traveller Niccolò de' Conti described the festival's intensity and importance as a grandeur religious and martial event with royal support. The event revered Durga as the warrior goddess some texts refer to her as Chamundeshwari. The celebrations hosted athletic competitions, singing and dancing, fireworks, a pageantry military parade and charitable giving to the public. After the fall of the Vijayanagar to Deccan Sultanates, these Hindu celebrations came to an end under Muslim rulers. The Wodyars of Mysore formed a kingdom in southern parts of the Vijayanagara Empire and continued the Mahanavami festival celebration, a tradition started initially by Raja Wodyar I in the year 1610 at Srirangapatna. <laughs> Festivities The festivities included a special durbar royal assembly. It was during the reign of Krishnaraja Wodyar III in the year 1805, when the king started the tradition of having a special durbar in the Mysore palace during Dussehra, which was attended by members of the royal family, special invitees, officials and the masses. After the death of Srikanda Wadyar in December 2013, this tradition has been continued by placing the Patata Kati royal sword on the golden throne. The ninth day of Dussehra called as Mahanavami is also an auspicious day on which the royal sword is worshipped and is taken on a procession involving elephants, camels and horses. <laughs> Lighting at Mysore Palace The main attraction of the 10-day Mysore Dussehra festival is the Mysore Palace which is illuminated daily with nearly 100,000 light bulbs from 7 pm to 10 pm on all days of the festival. Various cultural and religious programs highlighting the dance, music and culture of the state of Karnataka are performed in front of the illuminated palace. Procession. <laughs> <laughs> On Vijayadashami, the traditional Dussehra procession locally known as Jumbu Savari is held on the streets of Mysore city. The main attraction of this procession is the idol of the goddess Chamundeshwari which is placed on a golden mantapa which is around 750 kg of gold on the top of a decorated elephant. This idol is worshipped by the royal couple and other invitees before it is taken around in the procession. Colorful tableaus, dance groups, music bands, decorated elephants, horses and camels form a part of the procession which starts from the Mysore Palace and culminates at a place called Banamantap where the Bani tree is worshipped. According to a legend of the Mahabharata, Bani tree was used by the Pandavas to hide their weapons during their one-year period of Agnatavasa living life incognito. Before undertaking any warfare, the kings traditionally worshipped this tree to help them emerge victorious in the war. 
The Dussehra festivities would culminate on the night of Vijayadashami with an event held in the grounds at Banamantap called as Panjina Kavayatu torchlight parade. In Mysore, India, the Vijayadashami elephant procession during Mysore Dussehra is called Jumbo Savari from the British during their control of Mysore state. The original name to this procession is Jumbi Savari, going to the Shami Bani tree. Now Goddess Chamundeshwari is taken in procession on an elephant. But the Jumbo name is still intact. After the Jambu Savari, a torchlight parade takes place in the evening at the Banamantap parade grounds. Topic. Exhibition Another major attraction during Dussehra is the Dussehra Exhibition which is held in the exhibition grounds opposite to the Mysore Palace. The exhibition was started by the Maharaja of Mysore Chamaraja Wodyar X in 1880 with the sole aim of introducing timely developments to the people of Mysore. The task of holding the exhibition is now entrusted with the Karnataka Exhibition Authority this exhibition starts during Dussehra and goes on till December. Various stalls which sell items like clothes, plastic items, kitchenware, cosmetics and eatables are set up and they attract a significant number of people. A play area containing attractions like a Ferris wheel is also present to provide entertainment to the people. Various governmental agencies set up stalls to signify the achievements and projects that they have undertaken. Other programs On all the ten days of Dussehra, various music and dance concerts are held in auditoriums around Mysore city. Musicians and dance groups from all over India are invited to perform on this occasion. Another attraction during Dussehra is the Kusti Sparti wrestling bout which attracts wrestlers from all around India. See also Arjuna, the lead elephant of the Mysore Dussehra procession Dussehra disambiguation. Uses of the term in other Indian states Dussehra elephants Mysore Dussehra 2013